Today's recipe holds a special place in my heart. It's one of my mother's all-time favourite dessert recipes. And while she may no longer be with us, she lives on in the amazing taste of this dessert. Let's make a lemon cheesecake on the One Pot Chef Five Ingredient Desserts. First things first, we're going to start with our cookie base. And I'm using some graham crackers today. Now, I'm in America, so obviously graham crackers. If you're in Australia, it's arrowroot biscuits. If you're in the UK, digestives. About 250 grams, or about half a box of these graham crackers. And just break them up into the food processor. Now, if you don't have a food processor or a blender or something like that, don't panic. We can just put them into a snap lock bag and beat them up with a rolling pin. It's very good for the soul. And we're just gonna whiz these up until we've got nice fine crumbs. And we'll just transfer our cookie crumbs into a nice mixing bowl. There we go. And we're just gonna add in one stick of butter, about 100 grams, just melted, and just pour that into our cookies. And we'll just give that a stir until it has the consistency of wet sand. I've got a springform cake tin, that's one where the base comes off, and I've just lightly greased it with a little butter. And we're just gonna add in some non-stick baking paper or parchment paper, so our cake doesn't stick to the bottom. And we're just gonna pour in our cookie crumb mixture. And we're just gonna use the base of a flat bottom glass just to press that cookie mixture down so it's nice and flat and even. And our cookie crumb base is ready to go into the fridge. All we need to do is just pop it in there for about 10 to 15 minutes to chill while we work on our cream cheese mixture. Cream cheese mixture is very easy. We've got two packets, about 500 grams of Philadelphia style cream cheese. And we're just gonna put that into our mixer. Just make sure the cream cheese is at room temperature. Otherwise it'll be very difficult to integrate it into the mixture. And we're also adding in a 400 gram can of sweetened condensed milk. And we'll just beat this until it's nice and smooth. Next, we're adding in the juice and the zest of one lemon, one decent sized lemon, nice juicy one. We'll just juice that lemon. We're gonna start the mixer going again and we're just gonna gently pour a little bit of juice at a time as it mixes until it's all added in. And we'll just keep beating that until the mixture starts to thicken up a bit. And it's just a matter of spooning our cream cheese mixture onto our cookie base. This beautiful lemon smell coming off this. This is gonna to be tasty. And we'll just smooth the mixture out so we've got a nice even surface. And our no-bake lemon cheesecake is ready to go into the fridge for about six hours, preferably overnight, just until it's nice and set. And here we have our completed no-bake lemon cheesecake looking absolutely gorgeous. And just to finish off, I've just put a little bit more of that grated lemon zest over the top. It's not essential, but I think it really just adds that little bit of extra pop to it. Let's have a taste. Mmm. <laughs> mm. So rich and creamy and zesty and sweet. It doesn't matter how many times I make this, it always reminds me of my mum. I absolutely love this recipe and I hope you'll love it too.